is Movie Tone. Geoffrey Sumner reporting. Almost zero hour at Cape Canaveral, and enlarged 16mm pictures show a monkey specially trained and conditioned for voyaging in space. Two monkeys had been selected for the job. They called them Abel and Baker, A and B, of course. Each one, carefully space-suited, was placed in a small compartment in the nose cone of a Jupiter missile. And now they're off. It's a 1,500-mile journey, reaching a height of 300 miles and a speed of 10,000 miles an hour. Here in diagram is how the stages of separating the nose cone from the missile work out. It all looks simple enough, and if you'd like a view from the nose cone itself, here's the real thing. You're right there, looking back at the world. Back to a diagram again, as the flying monkey house automatically releases a parachute. After a quarter of an hour's trip, a gentle descent into the sea. Radio signals at once sent out a message to the rescue teams standing by. In fact, the monkeys came down safely near Antigua. Reported none the worse after blazing the trail for human space travel. The education...